this is actually a fun movie. While I'm not saying it's flawless or anything, but it's still fun to watch either way. <laughs> Today, I'm going to be reviewing TMNT, the 2007 animation that is. After the defeat of their old arch nemesis, the Shredder, the Turtles have grown apart as a family. Struggling to keep them together, their sensei, Master Splinter, played by the late Mako Iwamatsu, becomes worried when strange things are brewing in New York City. Tech industrialist tycoon, Max Winters, played by Patrick Stewart, revives four ancient stone warriors and enlists the help of the Foot Clan to help capture ancient monsters. Now, as always, since this movie didn't do well at the box office, I gotta start with the negative before I get into the positives. But honestly, the only gripes I had about this movie are the cinematography and the end boss fight. That's it. To get into more detail on them, the camera shots are not really as great as I want it to be, but at the same time, it's totally not on the standards of Disney's Chicken Little, so thank God for that. If you've seen my review of Chicken Little, you'll see why. Also, spoiler alert, during the final boss fight where all the turtles are facing off against the Storm Warriors, it's still an awesome action sequence, don't get me wrong. But what's missing about the fight is that when the portal is opening, I just noticed that none of the civilians are paying any attention to what's going on. They should be running around and panicking in that scenario. That was a mistake that needs fixing. Other than that, the animation was really great. The character designs in this movie are really good, to be honest. All the four turtles were designed well, even with character development articulation. Leonardo is one of the most popular characters among audiences. His character design was super flawless, I gotta say. This is what a true leader should look and feel like. James Arnold Taylor did a really great job portraying the character. Raph as well, played by my man, Nolan North. He's one of my favorites, to be honest with you. He's hot-headed, he's offensive, he's kind of like me in a sense. Speaking of which, the voice acting felt like the Ninja Turtles. The casting for the four turtles in this movie was handled excellently. It executes superbly well with the franchise. Not one actor or actress milked them in, there's an element of fun and energy to them, and they pulled it off impressively. The story and plotline, on the other hand, well, I'm not gonna say it was a hit or miss for me, but it felt a little short be honest. They should have kept it going after they finished the final boss fight. Also, the humor is just a tad bit funny, but not fully. But other than that, in the end, TMNT was a fun movie nonetheless. It was creative, original, and the turtles still kicked butt at the end of the day like the heroes in the half shells should be, and that's always important. So as a result, I rate TMNT 4 out of 5 stars. But here's the thing. If you guys have problems with this movie, that's totally fine. Everybody's entitled to their own opinions. I had a fun with it, that's no big deal. So TMNT 2007, have you seen it? If you haven't, if you're a Ninja Turtles fan, let me know in the comments what is your favorite Ninja Turtles property of any kind. But if you have, come back and let me know what you thought about it. Also, if you like this video and you want to see some more, make sure that like button shines in your face. That'll totally help me out a ton. Also, share that video with your family and friends and favorite it. Also, as you saw at the beginning of this video, to show even more support, why not donate to my Patreon account? Links in the description below. Now remember, you don't have to donate if you don't want to, but I would be mostly appreciated if you do. That definitely shows support for both my channel as well as my review. But until then, I'll see you next time. Peace. Out.